This is a general overview of operations of the Vigil AED manufactured by Advanced Aerospace Designs based out of Belgium. This is the main box of the unit that contains electronics, the battery, stainless steel filter, and the connections to the cutter and display. The battery must be replaced every 10 years and will last a minimum of 2,000 jumps. The company recommends replacing the battery every 5 years or 2,000 jumps, but it absolutely has to be replaced every 10 years. This is the filter. never needs to be replaced. If it does get wet, it just needs to be dried out. Turn the unit on. If it's operating correctly, it can be put back into service. Cutters are field replaceable. This happens to have a two-cutter system. This can be replaced with a one-cutter system. And or if the unit fires, it can also be replaced with a new cutter by your local rigger. The unit control portion of it does a self-test every time you turn it on. It's going to check the battery to make sure it's functioning properly, the cutter, and the electronics. It also will give you a menu option of setup, info, and configuration for different information or setting up the unit. And then we'll display the uh, current mode that it's in. To turn the unit on, press the button. Every time it flashes, press the button again. Goes through the setup process, checking the systems, the menu items of setup, info, and config, the enjoy portion. If you press the button during the enjoy portion, portion it'll return to the menu. If you let it proceed through the enjoy, it'll give you the pro, tandem, or student that you have it set on. Then the unit stays on for 14 hours or until you manually turn it off. If the unit is plus or minus 150 feet at the end of 14 hours, it will stay on until it returns to ground zero or you manually turn it off. The company says that you should turn off the unit if you're going to take the unit away from the drop zone or where you turned it on. To manually turn off the unit, press the button every time it blinks or flashes. Press the button until you see the goodbye, the Vigil 2, and a blank screen. The unit has a life expectancy of 20 years, and the unit never needs to go in for maintenance unless an error is noted during the startup process.